question for you I said, do you wanna sleep just like it? I get the feeling that there's not that case for the face Everyone has the right to go and see the other side So break down the barricade before it Joker. Let's go. Okay. Roger that. Here I come. Let's do this. It's my Leave turn. it to me. <gasps> hmm. Personified Tactica. Hey everybody, the Great Penguin Six Seven Nine here. Welcome to Let's Play Persona Five Tactica. Or Persona Five Tactics, if you really want to replace the A with an S. Now, uh. I'm gonna be honest, this is my actual first time getting into something regarding Persona. It, 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 yes, it's a spin off game, but it's still something Persona related. <laughs> Just in case this wasn't obvious, I would. Oh, I already purchased the DLC in advance. <laughs> and just for the looks of it alone, uh, seems like I'm able to do it just fine before starting the main story. <laughs> I'm not gonna turn on autosave, because fuck that noise. It was out change once we actually get to the game. Probably we'll able to actually hear the voices a little bit. Obviously, just as captains. Now, uh, <laughs> this is mostly going to be a little bit of a similar situation to how I handled Machine Break Chronicles Definitive Edition with the epilogue of the, that game's main story. I know, based on what I've heard, the DLC f basically takes place before the main story. And I know unlockable characters will be unlocked at the Completing this DLC. So in terms of how I'm handling this, the main story is gonna be like the 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 burger after we handle the side disc that is the DLC. If we want to get into food puns, I guess. <laughs> food analogy. I can words. Oh no, just. I know basically how Mainline Persona and Royal Girls, I. As far as I know, I don't need to play the games. Because I technically already do watch videos of it. I'm just gonna start the game now. <laughs> Gameplay is the DS story racing towards mechanics, the main story. So I recommend I play the DS. I'm gonna learn along the way. <laughs> Also, does want a balance between a rhythmic story and exciting gameplay. Yeah, I'm dealing with this. I, I think I'm gonna go with Sasaki as a as the surname because uh, this last name is translates to help or aid. <laughs> so I expect this to possibly be the same. Whenever I tackle the main story. Oh, 
Hey, your phone's going off. Kasumi just sent me a message. Kasumi, sorry. <laughs> I don't know why I said Kasumi's name like that. <laughs> she wants me to go in the alley nearby. Hmm? What's that about? I like to see him. <laughs> I like Jazzy Remix. Kasumi wants to meet up. Kasumi said that? Well, I can tell when something isn't my business, but I can't help worrying either. If you're heading out, I won't stop you. Just come let me know if it's trouble, alright? <laughs> I'll be back soon. Make sure you don't stay out too late either. Survive! <laughs> master known only as Guernica has made yet another huge splash in public. Many experts have heralded the pseudonymous street artist as one of the top talents in the field today. However, Guernica's radical subject matter and selected sites for murals continue to upset their critics. Each massive work is completed overnight, including the latest piece spread across the security department headquarters. Despite their first mural appearing in Tokyo over a month ago, the artist's true identity remains unknown. Local police have been grappling with growing criticism at their inability to track down the artist. While at the same time, public support for preserving these murals only continues to rise. Oh, shut up. Why do you leave the TV on? <laughs> Was the woman nearby? Because I sure didn't have seen one. Uh, senpai, sorry for the sudden request, but I really needed you to come here right away. <laughs> it, it's fine, I live close by. Still, thank you for coming. I would have preferred to drop in at the cafe to visit you. But after seeing this just now, I knew you should see it for yourself too. So, I came across some pretty strange art, and there's something especially surprising about it. Actually, I think it'll be quicker just to show you. This way, senpai. Ah, there it is. Aha. Uh -huh. That's interesting. Figure, isn't it? What's in? You think it looks like him too, don't you? It, it literally is him. Just way too similar to be a coincidence. That's why I reached out to you right away. That mural. Don't you feel like there's more to it? Like it has a really important message behind it or something. All I know is when I first saw it, and even when I look at it now, I get this strange feeling. Of course, I could just be imagining it. Well now, color me surprised. To think you two were the ones to beat me here. Akechi-san? What are you doing here? Hello, Yoshizawa-san. You as well. I admit, you never fail to impress. I hadn't expected you to look into this case as well. Sniffing out of the lead. You were unaware. Graffiti like this has been all over the news lately. Really? I mean, this is certainly unique, but... The subject matter speaks for itself, but the artist's M.O. is causing even more of a fuss. Recently, they've been splashing large murals like this one all over municipal buildings. At this point, I have to ask, do you two have anything to do with these? Wh what? We'd never do something like this! <laughs> I'm only pulling your leg. The questions almost ask themselves. Call it a detective's habit. <laughs> Pretty positive. They've turned the entire city into a canvas to share their disturbing message. And, considering the number of unauthorized sites they've chosen, their legal troubles are piling up quick. What do you think is making the artist go to such extremes? Do you know their secret identity? Unfortunately, no one's got that far just yet. The artist could simply be doing this for kicks. Or it could all be part of a grand criminal conspiracy. Perhaps there are declarations of crimes that will be committed. 
Or maybe their attempts at exposing some social injustice. Sounds like there are all sorts of possibilities. <laughs> the possibility. Okay. I'm not going to go. In I'm not going to bust into this song. <laughs> Nothing but speculation so far. But as long as they keep trying to communicate, I feel compelled to investigate. I'd rather err on the side of caution than have it come back to bite us later. <laughs> you know, quite literally. Now there's a detective for you. So, what have you sniffed out so far? <laughs> well, I've only just arrived on the scene. Let's see here. To start, it'd be nice if we could glean any clues from the mural itself. Hmm, that's a toughie. Senpai, did you notice anything yet? <laughs> I like the bowl stocks. <laughs> None of these are real interesting options. <laughs> Although, I guess the fairness is we really can't comment about the whole our scene being I'm about to be eaten by a rat. The mouth. You know, this actually is the first mural so far that's included one. Perhaps this is a new clue after all. Would you mind taking a closer look? Phantom Peeves. Phantom Peeves of Hearts. Who's saying that? <laughs> I can hear a voice coming from the wall. <laughs> I heard a voice in the wall. It's very strange. Do you think someone's trapped in the wall? <laughs> I have to say, I doubt that's the case. He's either hearing things or fooling around, or maybe. Or maybe the wall is about to suck us in! What the? The mural's glowing. Zap! No! How is this? It's sucking me in! <laughs> I was literally joking about the possibility of us suck being sucked into the wall. You gotta your hands! Where am I? Oh, hi. Actually, this is can't break your mechanics and main skip around the toys, get some defaults, man. Yeah, what to do here? Okay. Now that I don't think someone go audio wise, uh, gonna turn that down a little bit. That'd be real nice to have. That's my move for range. Firing range is pretty far. Is that the toys waves? Yep, right. Yep. Fire range weapons by pressing Y, red line indicates any target that you can hit, while black line indicates that any target cannot be hit from my position, okay. Move anywhere within your movement range freely, if you end up turning and hiding behind cover, you, you will resist and re-attack, eliminating will reduce the damage taken, and we units can take over as well. Melee attacks. From any type of present game, when you were close enough to an enemy unit, you will knock the back away from you and you will end your action on the square where you originally stood. 
Does not attack, does not inflict damage, does not do effects on two targets. Because sort of tutorial was <laughs> Thank you. When you talk to them, unable to resist your attacks, you are down them. You are then given another opportunity to act, this is called it once more. Doing it one more, if you down a target, you receive another one more. Target take to down a target to keep turn going for as long as possible. Basically, it's like an actual Persona game. A trooper threat is an all-out attack that deals damage across a wide area. It's made by surrounding a down enemy with all the party members, suppressing like ZR, which is even not just killing either one more. Damage by your trooper threat is based on your unit's melee and range attack stats. If any of the units are affected with an ailment, besides putting on despair, <laughs> why is that a, why is, why is despair an ailment? You cannot perform a trooper threat. Pressing A will allow you to skip the animation. <laughs> Give me the news of why this fails an ailment. Steals target's movement, thereby wasting the user's movement on the next move. The more targets hit at once, the greater the movement bonus. Okay. You can take high ground by pressing the A button when close to a ladder when standing on the jump platform. You're still getting on high ground, so it's going to attack some units to get on the ground. The floor being called the other end of it. <laughs> yeah. Basically. Okay. <laughs> I feel like that's pretty much all I will like to know for the time being. Uh... Hmm, this, this only is a camera system, I don't give it that much. Okay, so they have moved there. And they can only move there. And they can only move up there. Okay. <laughs> so, what? What the? This car's got some real shitty vibes. Ah oh, yeah, now talking. Give us some more of that. Here we go. I think it's poison is striking. Wait till you wait till you see what we do with the place. When one unit attacks an enemy unit, that team's pain is spread across the surrounding area. All units standing on their own team's pain gain resistance, even outside of cover. Conversely, any unit standing in on the enemy team's paint will not be able to attack and on will automatically be downed when attacked even if they are behind cover. Huh. So it's a little bit like Splatoon. Interesting. These rules apply to all units on the battlefield, not just your own party. Enemies standing on the one paint will have the effects of cover, as well as be knocked down if you attack them while they are standing on your team's paint. Keep the tides battle in your favor by forcing your enemy units to stand on your painted turf and avoid the ending your turn where the enemy has painted. Ah, okay. That, uh, that makes sense. Ah, hence why the paint buckets are everywhere. Yeah, that's the thing that paint fly! Man, do I love what these girls can do. Paint barrels explode after taking enough damage, surrounding the paint to the color attacker's color of paint. They can also be knocked back by melee attacks. Paint barrels cover wide swaths of turf much more efficiently than solely attacking enemies, so make good use of them whenever possible. Oh, Ow. Thank you. Oh, shoot, nice camera angle. All right. Ah, uh, yep. There we go. <laughs> Again, nice camera angle. Now, really appreciate the camera angles going on here. Uh, we're gonna gun that bill. And now, I can knock you over. Two for the fight one. Very nice. <laughs> Get down, buddy.
Nie nam oczekiwać, nie ma. Ja. I guess the last option is to just get a beer, huh? Okay. You can die now. Ow. What to do here? I haven't really used that piece, so... Yeah, go ahead and die. Driven to despair. Now then. Nighty. Now to take out the enemy's appeal. I'll go ahead and use my gun to shoot that bill. Alright. I'll go ahead and attack you. To get at least one of you down. <laughs> I'm gonna be wide range of cover, but they're mostly given to the others. Stuff. Oh. They didn't even bother. Okay. <laughs> Thanks for the free opportunity for attack, Sucker. There we go. Hello, man. All right. Down song is even if in cover. Persona. Yep. Wow. <laughs> Got him. Level two. <laughs> Took ten turns, but you know, I'm just stoning out. Just too many of them. Oh no, they've got me surrounded. There they are. Perhaps you'd prefer I hadn't cut in. Senpai, you're not hurt, are you? I'm fine. <laughs> so, what's next? I suspect they're not interested in conversation. <laughs> right. We'll take them down together. <clears throat> Suspected Yoshizawa-san also had this power. And I never thought you did. But does that mean, Akechi-san, you're also one of the Phantom Thieves? Well, we can discuss that once we've handled our current issue. Sound fair? Oh, right. Akechi okay, Kazumi has joined the party. See, we got a skill tree. Okay, it requires that. <laughs> Science of eternal darkness. <laughs> Very edgy. Of the heavens. Well, then, <laughs> figure that 
that'd be an almighty move. Oh, oh almighty akin. An almighty skill, I guess. I can't really know how to words, so I can't really do anything by that yet, yeah, because I don't have any GP. Don't have any personas to equip, so this is... <laughs> this is not helpful. So I just feel us a moment, so... <laughs> yeah, I, I guess we're just gonna go. How about... You may have already deduced this, but the pain in this world seems to have some kind of power. If we stand somewhere in pain like the color, we can't do much of anything. But... However, the enemy appears to have their own uses with the color of paint we're using. I see. Oh, so if we paint the place in a way that helps us... I'll leave to command to you, Joker, but let's make it our way out of here. I'll just go ahead and shoot that bill. Here I go. Can we need a bunch of fan? Yeah. that forward. I'll just stab you. <laughs> we can drop us down this one. <laughs> you want fuck it? Drop us down this one guy. <laughs> <laughs> Mostly overkill. How dare you? Oh. Oh, man. Shoot him up. Here we go. <sighs> mm, okay, problem. It's a nice wedge. <laughs> Sure, again, we'll go overkill for this one guy. Ow. <laughs> Buddy, uh, uh, I'm afraid you've made a terrible decision to, to approach you, uh... Smack -a Here I go. Okay, I just have you hide behind cover. Now, let's I'll wrap this up quickly. Firing. Here I go. Really? I... 
I can't shoot. He, he's not far out of range. Okay. All right, then just just wait here then. Oh crap. Ow. He counterattacks, that makes sense. I hope you're ready. I'm this close to victory. Yeah, now I can't get in my and consume his range. What to do here? Or at least hurt him in that range. Yeah. I'll just get rid of this guy. One alpha with 69, damn it. Would have been funny. See, it's clear. <sighs> I think we're free to talk now. Let's see. So, about a catchy son. Oh, and also where we ended up. Uh, what else? Let's take this all one step at a time. First up, as to your question whether I'm in the Phantom Thieves, hmm, I suppose you could say that's a tentative yes. <laughs> and that's a tentative with a very, very good reason. Hmm? What's he mean? Long story. Okay, sounds like it might be a complicated situation. But I get the picture. I won't pry any further. I appreciate your understanding. That reminds me. Like I said before, I'm surprised by your ability. But you didn't react as if that was the first time you've seen Yoshizawa-san like this. Oh, I can explain that, if you don't mind. So, a while back... And that led to you awakening to your power. Quite interesting. Yes. Although, I ultimately declined a spot in the Phantom Thieves, for personal reasons. Even if you're not a phantom thief, it's reassuring to know you can fight. Especially considering how the territory we've found ourselves in appears to have hostile forces. So you don't know where we are either. Is this not a palace of some kind? It's certainly a possibility. I can't say for certain. Considering our appearances here, it's safe to assume we're in a cognitive world of some kind. <laughs> Something's approaching. Mouse gosh, do you think we're going with this? A stuffed animal? No, that's... <laughs> What's wrong? Please, you can tell us. <laughs> there are 
more like you out there? We promise we'll save them. Thank you. Please. Oh. oh. Is... Is she... <laughs> I'm sure she's quite dead. She's our son. Don't be upset. Chances are she's not... Let's go. Right. It sounded like someone being attacked. I agree that we should investigate, but we're in unfamiliar territory. We should be especially cautious. Sure. We'll hurry cautiously. <laughs> sure. I think that's an oxymoron. Oh, we'd better stick together as closely as possible. Let's catch up with her, shall we? Are you lying? I'm sorry, I got carried away. But Senpai, look. What on earth? There are so many of them. <laughs> oh, I don't like that a bird can talk. I mean, it's very to make sense. <laughs> this is a massacre. How could that woman be so gruesome? What's wrong with her? Somebody needs to stop her. I mean, we've already somewhat observed what just happened. I don't know why the dialogue often is there. Right. I'm going to say something. Hey! Hey, we're sending you into this. Huh? Did you just walk up to me and tell me what to do? I'm not trying to boss you around, but I can't just stand here and watch you kill people. Jerry, who even is this brat? That yammering of hers is extra annoying. How peculiar. The streets shouldn't be accessible to outsiders. The three of you, what are you doing here? We're merely a few passers-by, we hope. If we haven't been able to make heads or tails of this world, would you be so kind as to point us to the exit? Wait, no, Akechi-san! We can't leave until we get them to stop hurting these people! <laughs> I really just want some pancakes! Ooh, she's right. How's about I stop hurting them right now? Ha <laughs> ha! Ah, Ganica. Struck yet again by inspiration? Uh, to be honest, I was getting bored with cooking the small fries. But with you here, I can perform a little experiment. Let's see if you bleed the same way the rest do. Oh dear, sounds like peace isn't an option. 
I was hoping we could get through this more amicably. <laughs> I mean, this is the DLC we're talking about. We're, we're kind of focused around her at this point. But it really isn't her to try. <laughs> oh, sure. Go ahead. Chat me up. Just one thing. To do it while bleeding out. <laughs> I would prefer to do it now with the bleeding out. It. Get ready, people. Okay, so I know we have items here. I think. Yeah, we got some personas. You got me. Hmm. Let's see. There's a regular guy over there. Move down there and move up there. I assume the eye means that people fuck the gonna go here. Him. You know, I bet Crushing you would give me some crazy good inspiration. <laughs> I can't wait! Gunnika, if I remember correctly, I believe that name is... We should focus on that right now, Ketchisan. That's right. You're right. And I'll think about that later. Let's neutralize her as soon as possible, whoever she is. All right, let's yeah, go. let's go. What to do here? Okay. Okay, well, for now we have high ground, and I want to keep that as much as I can. Hmm. Sweeps away. I'll wrap this up quickly. Let's see, um... Alright. Hmm. I think I saw I was shooting this way on Daniel. If the game would okay. I guess the catchy would take care of the bell. Talking down to him, okay. <laughs> I'll just do this so have the paint down. I'll use you over there. Just try me. Yeah, try Taking it me. easy on Ow. Come! 
Persona. Or set. Hey, yep. I'll wrap this up quickly. I'll just shoot you from up here. That's just that's a nice quit. Yep. Here I go. Taking it. And I'll eliminate you. Good job using that special on a barrel, I guess. I'll be fine. What to do here? I would eliminate this guy. I'll wrap this up quick. Alright. You get rid of that guy. Very nice. Just think there's one more guy over there along with Skunica. I'm just gonna yell. I'm sure it'll be fine. Just try me. All right. It's over. Shoot that. My turn. Get you up here. And we can bring you over there. Then we can shoot you with a with gun. Down you. I hope you're ready. Then consume me over here. I guess I might watch these <laughs> being targeted by Gunnika. I'll save on SP for now. I won't miss them. There we go. Let's take them down. Down, down. Get him! Oh, this is gonna be good. Ow! Get a load of this, gonna go. That hurt. Very good, very good. I'll wrap this up quickly. Now, let's dance. 
What to do here? Here I go. Now. Uh, just going to A, huh? My turn. Come to me. Make a deal. <laughs> what to do here? Gunnika, that was a weird nice shot of the wall there. It would be the same if we were up here when you were down there. <laughs> Gunnika, please. Don't know what you're doing, girl. That's just not how it works. Here I go. Uh, oh, I can almost reach the other. Okay, well, just move over there. You hide up there, and. I'll hide up here too. Oh, this is gonna be good. Not a chance. <laughs> Again, nice shot at the water, gonna go. All right. <laughs> nice AI you got, Dan. <laughs> it does the same. It's very unfortunate. It has to be this way. Now, let's dance. Uh, okay, I guess we had to bring her down to down to Mount of Elf. Okay. Why are you making this so hard on yourselves? Just bleed out from me already. Well, why would we do that? We're trying not to get killed here. Chill, chill. You know how this place is some kind of weird-ass world? We could splatter our guts all over this place. Just snap your fingers and everything's back the way it was. Huh? Is that really true? Sounds like rubbish to me. Perhaps you'd like to prove it on yourself first. <laughs> huh? Seriously? You jerk! You were trying to trick us! <laughs> it's almost as if he was trying to do so to begin with. this trash for me always foisting the tough work onto me what am i to do with you now my dearies finish them off senpai akechi-san there are too many of them come on put up a good fight for me i want to see a solid show before you go out with a bang but we're not going down so easily spot they clearly have the advantage what do we do <laughs> we need we need a strategic retreat we can't really more to more now is with the strength that we have right now that'd be the wisest move we have no reason to take them on it looks like their numbers are weaker over there maybe we can break through you idiot there's no escaping our forces what Oh, okay. What? Where did this hole come from? Come on. Not again. Ah. Huh? Where am I? Oh, right. Senpai. Akechi-san. We're both over here. Looks like we were taken for another ride. On the bright side, we're not about to be killed anymore. <laughs> It sucks too, we were totally winning the fight. Where do you think we are? It's so dark in here. <laughs> and the only light in, 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 in this whole place so far is currently from above. 
Looks like none of you were hurt. Some real lucky kids. A mouse girl? No, a girl dressed like a mascot? Oh, so cute. And you are? We'll get to that. How about a thank you first, considering I just saved your tails. Am I getting weird since the days of Uru? Was this just Morgana's voice acting again? Does that mean the hole we fell in, that was you? Sorry you got dumped here. I didn't have time to be choosy. Uh, oh no, not at all. We're extremely grateful. Well, as long as you're fine. I ought to ask, just who are you guys? How do you not know this place yet? <laughs> the streets are Guernica's territory. Nobody winds up here on accident. Not only that, you were able to square up with Guernica. I've never seen anyone else pull that off. It sounds as if you've been watching us for some time now. I sure have. <laughs> Sneaky one, aren't you? Until today, I was Guernica's only real opponent. No one else has tried stopping her. So you've got to be pretty sneaky to survive in the streets. So you... you're all alone here? Yeah. Not for a lack of trying to save them. But things are different now. You three can actually fight. Except... I don't know whose side you're on. So don't make me regret saving you. Understood. Well, at the very least, we're not your enemy. That's right! Although, I guess we have no way to prove that. Nah, I was just messing with you. I saw you standing up to Guernica. That was proof enough. I'm pretty sure this girl is the same. <laughs> it's just being voiced by Morgana again. <laughs> I would not be surprised if the equipment pulled up to see the voice actor for Morgana is the same as this at the mouse got, so. We may not have all the details, but I think I get the gist. If you wouldn't mind, I have some questions of my own now. First off, I'd like you to tell us all you know about this world. Am I right that Guernica is somehow involved in its existence? Yes, you are. The streets belong to Guernica. They were born from her heart. So, in a somewhat pseudo sense, is this a palace? Was well, like perfectly fine with that? Seriously now, who are you guys? You're not just on the ball. You know too much. You talk like you're already used to places like this. Um, well, we... It's a really long story. Yeah, a long and exciting story. Long and exciting? By any chance, are you the Phantom Thieves of Hearts? How the heck did she know? <laughs> it's almost like we're wearing Steve attire, Kasumi. It's almost like we're, we're, we're literally thieves in the places. <laughs> Get on to saying. You're the only one who looks so much gymnastic in that outfit of yours. Oh, good. My voice really did reach outside. I was worried this place was doomed. Your voice? Please come with me. There's something you need to see. Hold on. I still have quite a few questions. That's why I want you to see this. I think it would help explain things better. Got it. I'll take your word for it. Wow. <laughs> oh, and now I get new skills. <laughs> I guess now's a pretty great stopping point for... Well, like episode two of the last phase so far, just... Going after everything so far? Sheerness. Maybe like episode one? I don't know, I'm gonna cut this out. <laughs> Anyways, uh... I should write that down. So, yeah. Next time, let's play Persona 5 Tactics. Well, uh, we're taking our time to talk around with our allies and maybe pop a bit before going on ahead. See you guys then.